Puerto Ricans and everyone around the world love their Mexican food. So I've got a new spot for you in Isla Verde. This is Jovita Cantina. When you're in the lookout for a Mexican restaurant, you need to look for a Mexican owner, a Mexican chef, and a Mexican jefa. And that is Blady Margarita Mosri right here from Jovita Cantina. Thank you for welcoming us. This is amazing. I love the place. There's a lot of uh, photo opportunities. Um, tell us about the experience that people can find when they come to Jovita Cantina. Um, estar aquí en Jovita being in Jovita Cantina is being in a place where you can taste the street food of Mexico. It's like being in a small food store in Mexico, and that's what I'm bringing. Genuine Mexican food. What I go look for when I travel. Um, and that's what I look for in Puerto Rico. So what can people find to eat here? What will be one of the first dishes that I'll try today? Bueno, van a encontrar... Bien diferente el sabor. Eh, You'll be able to find very different and quality flavors. We have the mole, which is made in-house with the chile pasilla, guajillo, and all of the dry chiles the dish requires. We gave it the chocolate touch that everyone in Mexico knows, which is abuelita chocolate. We also have the birria, which is a lamb dish made just like in Mexico with tortilla, the lamb, cilantro, and onions, and the broth without any cheese mixes or anything that alters the taste of the broth, allowing you to dip it and fully enjoy it. That dish is very much on vogue in Puerto Rico, but I hear some people do it with red meat with cow meat but the legit way to eat a birria is with the lamb right it's a lamb stew es cordero. Le damos un trato para que la carne it's a lamb dish we give it a treatment with a marinade made out of dried chilies and spices we allow it to marinate for 24 hours and that takes away the strong lamb flavor then we cook it for eight to nine hours for a very tender meat what about this dish with the red and the green sauces La verde es de tomatillo. The green sauce in this dish is made of tomatillo, and the red sauce is tomatillo with guajillo chiles. None of the dishes are spicy, none of our sauces are spicy, so that you can taste the flavors of our recipes. I always tell my crew in the kitchen, if you're in a bad mood, get out of the kitchen and I'll cook, because when you cook, you have to cook with love. Amor y estar de buenas es lo que me encanta hacer. La diferencia son esas salsas, el tomatillo y el guajillo y el tomate. While I'm here, I will try the chile de árbol with my tacos. Okay, now, uh, drinks. I mean, well, some of the best things in Mexico are the drinks. What will I be trying out? Bueno, traemos obviamente la margarita que hacemos... Eh... Well, obviously, I'm going to serve a margarita, which is not done with mixers. We make them with the juice of pressed limes and a simple syrup made in-house and the best tequilas available. You can choose which tequila you'd like in your margarita. For the Jovita Margarita, we use 1,800 tequila. Tengo el patomar, que ha sido... We also have the patomar, which has been a hit with our guests. I have the full range of ducks, which you can choose your favorite, and we serve it in our small tub. You take the duck with you and collect them, but you leave the tub. La michelada tiene una gama impresionante. And of course, the michelada, which has a wide range of choices. How I like to serve it is with clamato, English sauce, Valentina, and your choice of beer. Valentina y la cerveza de tu elección. And a really big jar, a classic jar you feel here in Mexico. Okay, well, tell us about the location, opening hours, and where can people find out more information to either book or look at the menu before they arrive here. But I can assure you, it's going to be good. Estamos aquí en Isla Verde Mall. Inside Isla Verde Mall, across the Isla Verde Avenue from the cockfighting building and the Hampton Inn. Jovita Cantina is open every day except Tuesdays from 11 a.m. to 11 p.m. Fridays and Saturdays until 2 a.m. and the kitchen is also open until 2 a.m. for late bites. They also have live music on Fridays and they're bringing a great mariachi band soon, so you have to come and check it out. So if you're looking for good music, parking space, late night munchies, remember she has to rest sometimes, so that's Tuesdays. So come any other day of the week, this is Jovita Cantina. Thank you.